Okay, hey guys. <laughs> Welcome to Epic Kirby. This is a little different than my usual videos, but this is kind of what I want to get more into. I mean, <sighs> sorry. Anyways, we it is past midnight. Um, I want to do a video at midnight, but things got on the way. Anyways, so, but it's still after midnight, um, and yes. <laughs> for now, so we go into there. Um, <laughs> so we are headed to a cemetery <laughs> and we are going to be doing tooth or dare at a cemetery. Um, scary stuff. Yeah, I guess that's all I have to say. We will let you know when we I have something to say. Get there. I wear my sunglasses at night so I can, so I can. Yeah, I'm the one <laughs> editing this. I can cut this out. No! <laughs> Don't okay. edit it out. Anyways, we'll let you know when we get there. Okay, so we're here. Um, we're just kind of sitting on these steps. Um, the graveyard is right behind us, um, in front of us there's this big field and there's some um, flags, um, and AJ, you know, thinks that this is a military cemetery, um, for some reason I feel really freaked out, I don't usually feel freaked out at cemeteries, even at night, like, in Murray, I would go to the one in Murray all the time at night, and nothing but I feel scared to even go in there so we're just kind of at the edge <laughs> so let's start this video <laughs> um, so who should ask first well it is your channel so I think you should have the honors so I'm asking you okay Truth or dare? <laughs> uh, start out with, let's do a truth. What? Oh gosh, it's a flag. Oh my gosh, the flag sounded like someone was walking like right in front of us. That was freaky. Anyways. Okay. <laughs> so truth. Um, I'll do one of these spooky ones. But what is the most paranormal experience you've ever had? I don't know, whenever I was like around 13, every night whenever I'd go to bed, I was, I was sleeping in the basement this time at my mom's old house up in Evansville, Wyoming, and there'd be like a light on the wall, unexplained light every night whenever I went to bed and I covered up all the windows and it just didn't go away it's just there every night and some nights it wasn't which is kind of odd but for the most part it was there every night okay that's like not like any other paranormal stories. Like usually they're like knocking or something, but a light on the wall is a little different. I mean, it was unexplained, and I'm not. Yeah, no, that... I'm not saying that it's not paranormal. Yeah. I'm just saying that it's different and that's cool. So, yeah. Gosh, it's so hard to see because that light is like right in our faces. Yeah. Anyways. Truth or dare? Um. <laughs> I guess I have to make this video interesting. I'll do a dare. Don't make it too freaky, like making me hold a spider. You know my fears. Actually, I was going to have you go lay down with the graves. Oh my gosh. Fine. I'm a little freaked out, but. I'll follow her, you guys, with the light. So you do it for YouTube. <laughs> Let's go. 
I just heard a yell, but I'm sure it's nothing. Let's keep going. Okay, um... How's it make you feel away with your bed? Oh, gosh. No, I can't. No. That is freaking me out. What? I mean, I could probably do, like, a right next to it like that, but I can't lay on their bodies. I can't do it. Why, do you feel like their spirit should come right to yours? No, I just feel so disrespectful. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't. Hey, well, lay right next to them. Bye. You want to lay down? No ways you felt you're there. <laughs> Shut up. <sighs> I can't just, like, sit. <laughs> Nope. Yeah, fully lay down right next to him. For like, how long? At least 10 seconds. Okay. It's like, I'm not summoning anything, but this is still really freaky. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I can't. Four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're done. I'm back. Okay, back to the stairs? Back to the stairs. <laughs> I'm shaky. <laughs> that was a little freaky for me. Um, do the dare? Let's do a dare. I don't know, try touching your nose with your tongue. I already know I can't. I got a nope. short tongue. I have a long tongue. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm terrible. I'm better at truth. So. <laughs> but anyways. Uh, truth. <laughs> What's the worst experience you've ever had? In a cemetery. In a cemetery? That? <laughs> well, I mean, paranormal. Um. Is that what you're asking? No, just in general. I don't know. I mean, that was... I did not like that at all. But... I, I do have, you know, like another story that's more worse paranormal. Hey, don't look over there. You're freaking me out. <sighs> um, I have a paranormal one that... Stop! I said a lot of it ain't. Um, I, it was at the Murray one, and I know I just said that I didn't really, you know, get scared, but this one time I did. Um, there was, like, a certain tree that I, like, we were just, like, I think we were, like, playing hide and seek or something in the cemetery, and I walked past this tree, and I just kind of felt like really like depressed, and like I didn't want to be there, be that be by that tree. And later on, I was telling my you know, ex best friend Shay about it, and she said that she got the same feeling from the same tree. Okay, truth or dare? Let's go with the dare. You know I'm bad at this. <laughs> you know I'm bad at this. Okay. Okay, I have an interesting one. Please do tell. Okay, it's not like too scary. He, I've got to do... I'm going to say something really quick and about why I'm having you do this. Whenever I go to graveyards, I, I really like them. Um, not in like a weird way. I like them because I am, I love history. And so I like going to see, you know, when they were born and when they died. Just kind of see how long they lived and all that kind of stuff. And see what's, you know, the designs on them, see what was important to them. Um, so I want you, gosh, there's so many noises, stupid wind. I want you to walk. 20 steps that way or something and 
find, you know, the nearest one and, you know, pretty much look at their gravestone. You could take a picture or something like that, but then come back and tell me about it. That's easy. Okay. Yeah, see, I'm not good at this. This is the most interesting day I've ever done to someone. <laughs> okay, he's going back. Oh my gosh, this has a plaque on it. Mm. The stairs. Department and loving memory. Or, no. You have to edit that. <laughs> Dedicated in loving memory of all who have pre something. All who have preceded us the con steam con Cosentino family memorial day 2007 okay anyways <laughs> all right so i'm going to be using two flashlights okay so yeah, this right. one's james l garnett husband and father november 6 1939 to november 26 1986 that was a short life lived that is short and that was like uh, 20 days after his birthday. So I mean, it was in his birth month. And I need a flashlight on. Yes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> 20 days after his, it was in his birth month and 20 days after his birthday. November 6th. Oh. Oh, no, okay. I thought that was one of my Build-A-Bear's birthdays, but that's November 9th. Anyways, um, okay, so this is the last one. Last one. Let's see what I choose. I don't know if I want to do dare again. Gosh, I thought I saw someone behind you. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of funny things tonight and hearing a lot of funny things tonight. I don't know if I've ever been to a cemetery this late. Or early. Anyways, um, there. I'm scared. Please don't make it like the other one. <laughs> I regret choosing Dare now. <laughs> Already. I want you to go lay right next to the grave and say a couple words that are nice and kind. Do I get to pick the grave? Yes, you get to pick the grave. Fine. Not fine. <laughs> this is the grave that I'm picking. And his name is Salvador, which is pretty cool. But he was born on Christmas and died Christmas Eve. Like... That's pretty cool. Hey. Um, he go. was born Christmas in the 1920s. Oh, lucky. I'm facing him. Okay. 2005. Oh, pretty recent. No, it's not. That was only like a decade and four years ago. It's a long time. Oh, it's got a picture of Jesus. Anyways, um, like, what am I saying? Like, what's like, what? Whatever comes to your mind. What would think would be nice, even if you don't know the person. Like, I no. hope you're a cool guy, something like I that. I like your name. Say that's um, nice. You have a cool birthday too. Yeah. yeah. Very looks like it was very religious, which is a plus in my eyes. Hey, right. all up. these crickets are freaking me out. Honestly, all right, you're good. Okay, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want me to do more videos like this, you don't have much of a say. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, yeah. but yeah, you know, comment down below if there's anything that you would like, you know, like me to do. Um, just so you guys know, I am against Ouija boards and Bloody Mary.
Okay, let's just so that's out there. I'm against those. Um, I'm actually totally against Bloody Mary, uh, and also against Ouija boards myself. But don't get me wrong, I'll do a seance or some other type of stuff. But a uh, graveyard, we don't really think that's a good idea yet. No. Maybe, maybe in the future, but not tonight. Um, I need to get some rest. I'm, I'm going to be going back to the doctor's tomorrow. So. Yeah. I like. I hate how my glasses are like big bright. Eyes. My eyebrows look weird. Anyways. Anyways. <laughs> um, but yeah, comment any ideas and like, comment, and share. Uh, subscribe. And remember to follow your dreams. And I love you guys. Bye. Um, oh, the light went away. I got you. It's like we're coming up to a light. <laughs> but... Okay, so we're kind of walking out of the cemetery right now and just barely making it to the main road. Um, but we're just talking and I seriously get the weirdest feeling that like someone is like following us or watching us from behind. And I just get the weirdest chills from this place and now I've gave, gave it to AJ. I got goosebumps straight up all over my body walking out of this place. Like, Okay, we're at the main road now. I feel a little better leaving. Yes. But, like I said before, I don't usually get scared at cemeteries that much. But that one, I don't know. I feel like if I do another cemetery video, I want to be at a different one. Because this one's giving me the chills. Yeah, just wanted to add that <laughs> goodbye for real. <laughs>